I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And by the way, you know, I sit on the stand and it get hot. I got a lot of, I got hairy legs that turn, that, 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 that turn uh, uh, um, blonde in the sun. And the kids used to come up and reach in the pool and rub my leg down so it was straight and then watch the hair come back up again. They look at it. So I learned about roaches. I learned about kids jumping on my lap. And I love kids jumping on my lap. If you stand in the line, who owns CNBC? Who owns Fox? Who owns CNN? At the top of the shareholder list, you have Vanguard and BlackRock. Then you look at the manufacturers of the jabs. Ooh. Okay, Pfizer, Johnson & Johnson, Moderna. Who are the top shareholders mm -hmm. of those companies? Vanguard and BlackRock. Now you look at the flight companies that banned all flights. No flights unless you're taken care of. Who are the top shareholders? Vanguard, BlackRock. You look at the food. Okay, who are the top shareholders of all this junk food? Vanguard and BlackRock. So the media is controlled, the food is controlled, the narrative is controlled, the transportation is controlled. Who owns Meta? Who owns Snapchat? Who owns, well, used to be, but still kind of does, Twitter? Uh, who owns uh, Google? They're pushing the same narrative. The media is pushing, oh, it's the same company. It's BlackRock. It's Vanguard. Profit-driven companies. You can do two things. You can run and fucking hide, curl up in a ball, and let the world just fucking beat you to death. Or you can dig your fucking heels in, and then you fucking you dig in and you fight. The day we got back from Mexico, I had a quote installed on my wall. It says, may God have mercy upon my enemies, because I won't. So let's fucking go. Not only in the states most heavily affected, but in every place in this country are rightly disturbed by the large numbers of illegal aliens entering our country. We simply cannot allow people to pour into the United States undetected, undocumented, unchecked. People who enter the United States without our permission are illegal aliens, and illegal aliens should not be treated the same as people who entered the U.S. legally. I voted. Uh, uh, numerous times when I was a senator to spend money to build a barrier. I voted for a fence. Some of you won't like it. I voted for 700 miles. We are a nation of immigrants. We're also a nation of laws. That's why our administration has moved aggressively to secure our borders more by hiring a record number of new border guards by deporting twice as many criminal aliens as ever before. Illegal immigration is wrong, plain and simple. And we must do more to stop it. So whoever the fuck doesn't like the United States of America, may God bless you. But fuck you at the same time. If you don't like the United States of America, go back to the countries that we the fuck from and you'll see how much you appreciate the United States of America.